guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to do our mega haul. Every month, it seems like I collect enough boxes to do a mega haul. I kind of keep my boxes in like a little quarantine area. I don't actually open them right away. I shop like a little bit here and there. So if I try to haul like just my Sephora haul or just my Teamy haul or whatever, it really wouldn't work out because I would only be showing two or three things. So for me, the mega haul works better. If you guys don't like it, make sure you let me know and I will try to make smaller, shorter videos. I know this one always ends up being around 30 minutes. Let's start with this little small box. This is a Teamy box. I'm really bummed actually because I am a Teamy affiliate and they gave me 25% off to share with my viewers and they just changed it to 15. The 25 works for like a couple more weeks but then after that it's going to be switched to 15. So it's gonna be proof 15 and you'll get 15% off anything on the Teamy website, $29 or more. I got this mask because I posted on my Instagram story if you guys would like to see me review this one because I've been using the green tea mask to review their matcha green tea mask. So that green mask and I got the partner, which is the blue mask. This is the beauty restorative clay mask. It has zinc oxide, also has kaolin clay, just like the other mask. But this one is supposed to be like more nourishing. It has a butterfly pea in it. So I'm excited to try this one out as well. And you'll get a review on both of them. I think I'm gonna put them both in the same video. This next box is from Urban Outfitters. I did buy a lot of things during Labor Day. So I'm thinking this is probably a Labor Day sale I bought. Oh, I got this like, <laughs> this is a heat pack llama. I totally forgot I got this. So cute. It's a lavender infused and it's just a pocket heat pack. You put it in the microwave and it's just shaped like a little llama. Let's go to this actually. This is PR. This was sent to me. If I like it, I will definitely make a dedicated video to it, but I have, I'm not sure if I like it yet. So the way that PR works is a brand will send me something to review. And if they think I'm going to give it a positive review or if I'm, if I want to give it a positive review, I would share and say like, hey, here's this new thing that I just tried and I love it. If I don't like it, a video just never gets posted. This is Lux SB. It's a luxury scent box. And they sent me three fragrances and I think it's like a little bottle to miss them. So I'm definitely gonna try this. I have not smelled any of it. If they got me spot on, I gave them some information about some of the other ones that other brands that I normally wear and like. And supposedly they can pick up from when you tell them the different ones that you use, what types of notes you usually look for, and then they can custom send you little perfume bottles. We'll see. It sounds like a great idea. So I'm really excited to try it and I have seen it on other videos before and other people love it. So I hope I love it as well so that I get you guys a dedicated video. Let's do the Bath and Body Works down here. So my favorite scent at Bath & Body Works that is not pumpkin scented in any way is this Black Cherry Merlot scent. I have a ton of candles in the scent and I buy a lot of hand wash, hand soaps in this scent as well. So I did get two. I got the normal gel one and then I got the gentle foaming one. So obsessed with this scent. If you haven't smelled it, so good. I like cherry ice cream too and I like red wine, so it's two of my favorite things. I got a couple of pumpkin, or maybe three? No, it looks like I got two pumpkin. This is the sweet cinnamon pumpkin and the, oh, sweet cinnamon pumpkin, so I got both. And then I got this coconut pumpkin latte. Okay, I did get three. I got coconut pumpkin latte. I'm kind of excited for this one. I've never smelled this one before. Oh, it smells so good. I think I like this better than the sweet cinnamon pumpkin. That smells so good. It's like a little bit more refreshing because of the coconut. And then I got warm vanilla sugar. That's just kind of like a staple. I got mini hand sanitizers because we totally need hand sanitizer right now. It has alcohol at 68%, so it is COVID safe, whatever. This is in sweet cinnamon pumpkin. So it's the same as the hand one. It is, that's my favorite pumpkin set, the sweet cinnamon pumpkin. But I just got a bunch of new candles that have new pumpkin scents that I have not smelled yet. So it might be that we come with a new favorite pumpkin scent this fall. So this is pumpkin apple. 
Ooh, that smells, it's like a combination of apple pie and pumpkin pie, like if you were baking both at the same time. I love that, there's a lot of cinnamon in it, but I love cinnamon. That is really good, oh my God. Some of them might be repeats too, I just like to get different. What is this sticker? Yeah, this is pumpkin apple, so also a repeat. I just like to get different color candles, so then they're not like super matchy matchy. I don't know why. Oh, these are packaged, interesting. So this one is pumpkin clove. I expect this to be just like pumpkin pie. It's not. It's kind of like pumpkin bread or something spicier than pumpkin pie, but still smells delicious. Does anybody else just absolutely go crazy every time there's a sale? So this is pumpkin pecan waffles. That is good, but it is sweet. This is something that I would only be able to burn for a couple hours because the ones that I burn all day, they can't be super sweet or they give me a headache. Even though I love the scent of the super sweet ones, I don't know if that happens to anybody else, but I just get a headache if it's just on too long. This is my favorite, and that's why I got basically everything else over there, the hand soap and the hand sanitizer. Sweet cinnamon pumpkin. It's a lot of cinnamon, but it's not too sweet. It's like the perfect amount of sweetness that I could burn this one all day long. And last one. This is another pumpkin pecan waffle, so I just got a different style. That is all the Bath and Body Works. I feel like that's actually not that much. I feel like in the past I would get like 10 or 12 candles, but I have so many candles right now that it's probably best that I did not do that because I should probably burn the ones I have before just going crazy and buying more. It's so hard not to want more because the scents change and they come out with new ones and then there's new fall ones and I haven't even used all of last year's fall ones, although I think I only have one fall one left from last year, so it was time for sure. Whew. I think we're about a quarter of the way. This box is from, nobody knows, it's a mystery. Oh, this is this is also from Urban Outfitters. Okay, I got this headband and I'm so obsessed with this. This was on clearance. It's like metal, but it has these cute, like chain looking features to it. I don't know, I thought it was so cute and it's gold. What do we think? I'm obsessed. Okay, we're gonna wear this the rest of the video. Then I also got this like waffle, kind of like thermal. It's so hot right now. I don't even know how I could possibly put this on to show you, but it has like a tie front and it's like thermal and oversized. And I just thought it would look really cute with my non-black leggings, like any non-black leggings. Then I could put this over it. So what size did I get this in? It looks really big. Oh, I got it in a small, but it's supposed to be oversized. Definitely looks big for a small. This is also candles. This company I found on Instagram and I got obsessed so right away. It's called Mother and Son, but Son is spelled S-N-U. And the company is like actually a mother and son that together they make candles and soaps and it's just so freaking cute. They also have that they um, donate some of their proceeds to like racial injustices or human rights organizations. So I like that. I love any kind of company that has a really good give back story and that it's really important to them. And I just thought it was so cute that they like make these together. I don't know. I don't have a son, but I feel like if I did have a son, I would want him to make candles with me. Okay. One of the bottles broke. I should probably grab my phone and take a picture right now. I'm so upset right now. But I'm gonna pull out the mini candles because I got mini candles in a bunch of scents. This one is Fresh Cut Gardenia. It's very nice. Then I got Spicy Cinnamon and Orange. I like that. That one's really good. This is gonna be a good holiday scent. And then this next one I'm most excited for, it is Roasted Coffee. Oh, that smells so good. Oh my goodness, I love that. Meditation, lavender, and lemon. This is a good like bathroom scent. Then I have coconut and sea salt. Love it. That one's really light, but it's tropical. Obviously when I buy something, I don't just buy one thing. Um, spa day, cucumber, and mint. Oh my gosh. This one and coffee are my favorite for sure. Then, I think they also like sent me some extras because I did not order these specific soaps. I ordered one soap and it's over here. It is their roasted coffee and hemp soap and it's a scrubby soap. 
So you guys know that I like to use coffee as an exfoliator. This has coffee little beans all over it. And I feel like this, because it's gonna suds up, is not gonna be as bad as a coffee scrub. You know, like some people don't like how messy they are. This is gonna be completely different and still give you some of that exfoliation. So I'm very excited about this. This one is a meditation lavender and lemon, and this one is spa day cucumber and mint. I think I got these like as a bonus because I don't remember ordering those. And then here's like a little sample for their spicy chai bath salts. Love that. The salts that I did get <laughs> is this big container. And as you can see, it is so broken. So sad, it is eucalyptus and a rosemary bath salt. So that is my order from Mother and Son. I'm gonna actually move everything out except that one. Whenever you ship anything, you know UPS is not being careful with their boxes. This is from Bloom Supplements. I talked about their greens before and I think I have another greens in there. I pretty much buy their greens at least one container a month. I drink it at least once a day. Here's the greens, I'm obsessed with them. This is the one thing that I buy from them that I consistently buy from them every single month. I do like their pre-workout as well, their high energy pre-workout, but I don't use that up fast enough because I'm not working out as much as I should right now. But on their Instagram, and I normally don't buy whey protein powder, but I have been putting their whey protein powder into my coffee. I'm not vegan, but I do try to buy vegan versions of everything. They don't happen to have vegan protein powder. So they came out with a pumpkin spice protein powder and I've been putting their chocolate banana in my coffee and it's so good. Like so, so good makes the best mocha ever. So when I saw this, I was like, oh, I could make pumpkin spice lattes that are healthier. So that's how we got this. I don't know how they convinced me, they just do. And their last, their other protein powder is so good. They also have one that's iced coffee that I've wanted to get, but I just never, I, I just haven't gotten it. I need them to come out with a vegan one. I need to message them and be like, you need a vegan one. This is the cutest tape ever. This is from Sweena. I don't know how to say, say her channel name, but I'm gonna link it and also put it up on screen right now. But this has unicorn tape. I think I won one of her giveaways. That's how I got this. She does a lot of FabFitFun un unboxings and she's from the UK. All kinds of like free sample stuff and how to get them. Oh my gosh, there's such cute stuff in here. How cute is this? It has little leopard print all over it. Oh my gosh. We're switching it up. We're switching it up. Oh. I love headbands, like love headbands. I actually used to wear one every single day when I was in college, like without fail every single day. I used to work in a restaurant. I would wear it to a restaurant. Like they never said I couldn't. It was my signature. I don't know why I don't wear them anymore because I love them, but I just don't wear them as much anymore. I think cause I have color in my hair. Sometimes it's like harder to like match. And then these cute little like barrettes. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Everything in here is so cute. What is this? I don't know, but it's cute. It's like a little container maybe. I was expecting, I'm pretty sure that it was like an Elemis um, giveaway. I didn't know it was gonna come with like all kinds of extra cute little stuff. Or I would have opened this box so much sooner, like right when I got it. It says vanilla. It smells nice. That's so cute. This packaging, where did you get this? Oh my goodness, I love that. I see Elemis at the bottom. So this is Clinique on it and it has like this really pretty color, like super colorful stuff all over it. Goodness gracious, look how much is in here. Goodness gracious, okay. I can't even show you all of this. There's some It Cosmetics in here. There's some Too Faced. It's just a bunch of like little samples. Essence, I haven't tried this but I've heard other channels talk about it a lot. More It Cosmetics, Fresh, Ciate London, we have Urban Decay. Okay, so, so much stuff, wow. They use a lot of fragrance, that's the only downside to Elemis in my opinion, because I really love the ingredients and it just seems to work really well for my face, like no matter what I get and I end up liking it. The Elemis Dynamic Resurfacing Facial Wash. But we also have other things. So this is Physician's Formula. Wander Beauty, I love these actually. We have Bare Minerals. What is this little guy? It looks like a face wash cloth type thing. And more Elemis, the Super Boost. Then we have Elemis, the Pro Marine Collagen. Then we have we have a YSL powder compact, matte finish and blur. You guys know that I need that. Elemis toner. 
and another marine collagen. This, I feel so spoiled right now. This is a lot of stuff. Cleanse and polish hot cloth cleanser. So I guess that goes with this cloth. Yeah, they're the same brand. And then we have one last thing in here. Disney from Catrice Cosmetics. It's an eyeshadow palette and it's Daisy. Oh my goodness. This is purples and I love purples. Oh, this is so cute. I love Disney so much. Like it's unreal. Last year I went to Disney on my birthday. I think I went to Disney World like four or five times last year. I don't even live near Disney World, so. And then I went to Disneyland probably like also four or five times last year and I do live near Disneyland. Thank you so much, this giveaway. Okay, you guys, <laughs> you're sleeping on some of these giveaways. <laughs> I cannot believe how much I got in this giveaway, wow. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. I'm linking her channel down below. It takes a lot of energy and effort to run a giveaway, to put a giveaway together like this, to ship it out. And let's cut this off so we can wear this the rest of the day now. So we're gonna wear this one now for the rest of the video. I love it. That's so cute. Okay, this is totally my style. Let's move on to my monthly underwear. This is actually a really fun pair. I remember this email. So this month's style of me undies is tie-dye. These are very true to size, by the way. I did get that question last time. Because I talk about these so much, literally, they're so soft, okay? Just wear a t-shirt and this and like be comfy around your house. It's perfect. They are the best material ever. And the material lasts so long. I've had the, I've been getting this for almost three years, I think. I definitely have everything from the past two years. The fabric is super soft and it's really good quality and lasts forever. So I ordered, sometimes they send them to me, but this time I ordered them with my own money, more all dashing nails. I got one, I got another one of the black and gold style that I liked with the leopard print because the other set that I have, I used them twice. So I used them and then I used them reusable. It does not seem like you can reuse them a third time. You can still use some of the nails that you hadn't used, but to reuse it three times after pulling it off, they just, they're not up to the challenge anymore. So they're reusable once. I got these really cute ones for Christmas that have like, I'm already thinking about Christmas. I already started like, semi planning like all the decorating of my house for Christmas. It's 2020, I can decorate as early as I want this year. These have this little like, what's that sweater print called? I wish I knew. It's like checkered sweater print, plaid. So I have a plaid nail, a glitter nail, and then the rest are red. And then I got these that are black marble and like matte and pointed. They are my obsession. You guys, I spent my own money on those. So I know that I'm an affiliate and sometimes they do send them to me for free because I'm an affiliate, but they are so good that I also spend my own money. So I never recommend anything to you that I would not spend my own money on. I'm not in the business of trying to make profit from YouTube. That's also not, that's not the reason I started it. And like becoming an affiliate to me was just, sure, if I'm already recommending it to everyone, why not do it? Yes, I do make commission. It does not charge you any more to use my link. And you are welcome always to just type in the name of the brand in your web browser and not use my affiliate link if you don't feel right about that. Oh my God, I forgot I bought this. Oh my goodness, I totally forgot I bought this. So I bought these build your own bath bomb sets. I got one for myself and one for my 4K giveaway. I totally forgot. So yeah, there are reusable bath bomb molds and then everything you need to create your own bath bombs with your own scents and whatever. It includes like a 64 instruction manual and everything you will need and you can of course customize it so one of these is going in my 4K giveaway. That will be coming soon. I'm actually going to have two winners and it's gonna be seven days of videos. So there'll be seven potential videos. Two of those videos will be randomly selected and then a comment from those will be randomly selected. There's gonna be just seven days straight. So stop by every day and get your entry in because you have seven videos. It could be any of those videos. Two of them will be selected and there'll be two winners that get to create their own EP box. I'm so excited about this though. I can't believe I forgot that I bought that. So I also got these, it's called like Nido. This was on clearance at Urban Outfitters. I think it was like $2 and normally it's six or something like that. How do we open this? And you squish it and it changes color but it's supposed to be like one of those relaxing things. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this is quite relaxing. 
yeah this feels really good okay so i got three of those and then this is a crystal geode bath bomb right now my puppies took over i have three bathrooms in my home and my puppies took over my bathroom that has the bathtub in it so i have not been taking bath bomb baths because that one's just big enough that if i put a puppy gate it's like perfect for them so i have not been able to use my bath bombs but how cool is this it has a rose quartz inside supposedly rose quartz is about like beauty and self-love and i don't know so hopefully that helps i'll get in the bathtub and i'll come out loving myself this is a boxy charm pop-up i got a lot in this pop-up sale so here we have the sigma viper shadow palette i have never had a sigma palette but i love sigma brushes and also this green i'm obsessed with green shadows and purple shadows so this green spoke to me then i got a couple of briogeo products i got farewell frizz and i got their volumizing conditioner this is their smoothing shampoo and their volumizing conditioner briogeo is one of the brands that just like my hair loves it was like made for my type of hair we got a blood orange sorbet sponge gel this does not disappoint but it does have a little bit of a cologne scent to it but it's mostly fruity it's mostly the orange scent i got the luxie iconic eye set i got two sigma mats one for me one for my giveaway so this will be an option in the giveaway you just roll this mat onto your sink and you can wash your brushes and scrub them on the scrubby pieces of this mat to help you clean your makeup brushes. I got these so, so cute. Okay, I love Corksicle because they keep your drink super cold or super hot. It says nine hours cold, three hours hot for these, but I got their basically like flutes. They're like champagne style ones. I got a Becca Luminous Blush. I am obsessed with Becca blushes. My favorite is Snapdragon. It will always be Snapdragon. I always like to try new ones. So this is Fox Glove. So <laughs> I don't know why I'm laughing, but I got this pineapple lamp. <laughs> It's not gonna go with the flow of my room. My room is gonna be marble and like super like classy, black, gold, white. Definitely not gonna go in here. Maybe a bathroom or something. And I got more Lexi brushes. This is the last thing that I got in the boxy pop-up. They actually gave me like a credit for something. I don't remember. I think it was because of the choice item. There was like no choice items left for premium except for one. So they gave me a credit for the store and this is what happens. I end up buying the whole store. Okay. So I don't know if you guys remember, like a while back, what the heck, why did I get these? Rubberized gloves? I'm gonna have to check, but I'm sure I did not order that. I don't know if you remember, my first ever mega haul, I got some Supreme sweatpants and like a top that matched, and I love them. I wear them all the time, but then I saw another top, like another t-shirt that matched, and how like freaking cool is this t-shirt? I'm obsessed with it and it totally matches with my sweatpants. So had to get this. Supreme sells out like right away and I love anything that's exclusive. That's just who I am. Like I'm just like, oh, I have one of something that sold out. So as things sell out for some reason, they become more important to me. And I do like the style of all the Supreme stuff that I order and I do like the quality. This is great quality, but that definitely has a little bit to do with it. The fact that it sells out and that it's honestly, it sells out because of robots and because they purposely don't make enough. But in my head, it's like I got something that ended up selling out and I love that. But they also sent me these gloves, rubberized gloves, which is interesting. I don't know why they would just send me this, but they did, so cool. Two more boxes. Okay, next box is from Overtone. Overtone is how I get my hair color the color that it is. <laughs> I've bleached my own hair. I will link that video. You have to have bleached hair. They do have color for brown hair, but it just gives your brown hair like a tint to it. It's not like fully noticeable unless you're out in the sun or the light, but you can still use their color for brown hair. I have black hair. I do not have brown hair. I cannot use their color for brown hair. So I do bleach the bottom of my hair. Then I cover it with Overtone. Overtone is a colored deep conditioner. So it's helping repair my hair while it's depositing that color. 
The color is always nice and bright. I don't know like how great it turns out on camera, but in person it is very bright red right now. The first thing I got has zero color. This I'm gonna use on my black hair. It's just as good, smells just as great, feels just as great as their color conditioner. But if you don't want color in your hair and you just want the benefits, this stuff is amazing. Then I got my color in red, extreme red. I'm thinking about going orange, but I also saw this like tie dye red to orange and tie dye blue to purple. So I'm not gonna do the tie dye blue to purple obviously because my hair is red, but I'm considering doing red to orange. Kind of like fire. I don't know. Let me know what you think. So this is the deep conditioner. This is what you're gonna put on right after your hair is bleached or if you are like right when you're gonna deposit the main color. Then they also have a daily conditioner if you wanna keep it as bright as possible in between when you do this. So I do this like every three or four weeks and I do this every other day or every three days. Definitely helps keep it red. If you're about to switch colors though, so when I go to orange, I'm gonna stop doing this and I'm gonna use a clarifying shampoo and get all my color out so then I could switch to orange and it'll look as orange as possible. My last box is from Amazon. It came from Royal Craftwood on Amazon. And I really just wanted to spoil myself. That is exactly why I got this. Not that the other things aren't spoiling me, but this was something that I was like, you don't need that at all, girl, okay? You really don't need that, but you want it. So this is the Bamboo Bath Caddy. And it has a spot for a cup of wine. This is a circle that's made for a candle. Everything you think you could possibly need, this is where you would slide your wine glass in. <laughs> no joke, that's literally what it's made for. There's a picture right here of a wine glass. They thought of everything. It's a little more than I would normally spend on such an item, but I just really wanted to spoil myself this month. This is like the Rolls Royce of bath caddies, okay? And that's what I got. That's it, that's my haul this month. Let me know in the comments down below what item was your favorite. As always, every single comment helps my channel out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye.